Poland. And how did you find out about Germany annexing or, you know, basically coming to take Poland over? What what happened? What, oh. what led up to it? Can you explain what led up to that? How you guys saw it being there? You are talking about the... the, the t- how did Germany right, but, occupy Poland? Like how, how like the, the, first the, reaction? The, 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 this is a, a history part. You know, Hitler came <coughs> out of jail uh, in 1933. He created his uh, Hitler's party, you know, the brown shirts. And uh, after that, naturally, he had his eye to control Germany. Germany was impoverished by the First World War. Naturally, the whole world took their money away for reparation. The money became worthless. People were unemployed and so on. So naturally here comes uh, uh, somebody that tells you that heck, we are going to have a great Germany, everybody will have a car, Volkswagen and so on. So people join him. They joined him, then he had those uh, fighters, those brown shirts and he, it's in a history book how in Nuremberg he made a raid on a bar, that's the beer putsch they call it, and beat everybody else. They went down the street and started smashing Jewish, uh, Jewish stores, settlements. settlements and everything. It was a, a time of rioting uh, from 1933 to 1935. Uh, he got power. People were for him because he was the only messiah that promised them power. May, the, can, I, can I interject? Good. Okay. At that time, in that time frame, there was a, a meeting between Chamberlain of Great Britain mm-hmm. and everyone with Germany mm-hmm. trying to appease them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was uh, Brit- I forget British, the right. The what yeah. happened is Chamberlain. Is that the did, Potsdam Accord? Yeah, uh, it was exactly that. Mm-hmm. Where Chamberlain said he would not do anything right. if yeah. Germany yeah. invaded Poland. When Germany invaded Poland, which it wanted to do an expansionism of Germany for its own economic wealth, okay, they took over Poland in one day with the tanks and the armored patrols. And that's where the term Blitzkrieg came from, mm-hmm. where it's called the lightning charge. Yeah. Okay, where in one day they took over the whole country of Poland, exactly yeah. like California taking over Arizona yeah. tomorrow. That's it. That, that's exactly what I wanted to explain. Like, right. What, 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 that's what, 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 what I want to get on yeah, the see, point here. Yeah. Uh, when we came uh, early, uh, we can stop at any time. In uh, 1935. Hitler got power. He went uh, to uh, Hinder, was it Hinderburg? Yeah, Hinderburg. Was the Chancellor of Germany, which is like a president here, you know. He gave him ultimatum that I am taking over uh, the country. Well, they collapsed. They gave him that country. Then shortly around that time, he burned the Reichstag. Burning the Reichstag, Reichstag is uh, like our capital, Senate and Congress. He burned it. And uh, there was no more legislation in Germany. It was burned, finished. Uh, then he took, uh, became Chancellor of Germany himself, he named himself, and became a ruler in '35. And naturally, the whole German population expanded into the area of supremacy uh, and guilt. Uh, you have to blame somebody for what you did wrong or something. So uh, Germany uh, kind of expanded the anti-Jewish anti-Semitic Not much. Uh, idea. Very soon Gables became the uh, 
That's a matter. Secretary of Propaganda gave us with his five children, you know, that died in Berlin. And uh, the, the work that everybody start hating Jews, but making it material, you know, you can hate somebody, but you don't do anything, you know. But when you start doing something, you have to make a riot. You have to burn the synagogue. You have to kill somebody. That all excited the other people. They all got excited. They, they are somehow getting ahead. They, their propaganda that was a psychological thing, you know, is working and they are beating Jews here, they are breaking these businesses and so on. Is it all that that you're supposed to talk? I don't know. No. Uh, there no. there no. is an editor. So this is when the ghettos first started forming. Yeah, yeah. and then very soon, uh, uh, but you can pick it up from the history of the book mm -hmm. if I am wrong with 